Good morning, it's March, Friday the 13th. See this, uh, this is called a, a Machtruhoff. It's a, it's a beer bar. But I've been thinking, I mean, I'm running a story right now and I want to include this bar because I like, think the outside looks so cool. This is like a really old style, 60s, 70s style place where people go to drink in their, um, they have these in, in everybody's neighborhoods, millions of them. They're like Korean style pub. <coughs> I just go into the store to pick up a couple of things. Well, actually, I have it already. A couple of packs of coffee, a back pocket hazelnut. There's the overpass that leads into the uh, area that's been developed for quite some time now. And I'm leaving behind the stuff, the old, the old part. Some uh, nice path, foresty walkways, the new part. And then into to where I live. Nine o'clock Friday morning. Everybody is already in school or at work. So my little neighborhood, my little neck of the woods is quiet now. It's still light. Steam from somebody's boiler heating up their house, their floors, church. You can tell that it's so quiet. Look, go to the church parking lot here. Good look out of um, some places that are really close here. And these are people are all living in here now for about another year, perhaps. Then you see down below there. This is a whole dense area of houses that are going soon. These ones at the top are a bit bare. Uh, sorry, the people are not living up there anymore. This is the new development. Recent building and the new development down below. So I have a day off, but it never means I have a free time. I have a lot of errands to do, and I've got a lot of, do, a lot of internet stuff. I got a TV commercial that I'm casting for, so I've got to find out models, the visas, availability, and then have them go in for a camera test and photos and then the director picks from there who he wants for the TV commercial. They're quite picky because there's a lot of money in these productions. That's what I do most of the, most of the time in casting now is TV commercials because it's very systematic and very professional and when there's a lot of money going into a production then there's a lot of organization and punctuality Movies are very, very difficult. There's no unions <coughs> here, so um, the money is always different on every job. Um, we get a lot of last minute information. So people who, who live here, they have basically their full-time jobs. And if they're actors as well, they have to um, kind of be on call. But if you're, say, for example, a teacher working Monday to Friday, um, then you get a call the night before and you get a shoot. That kind of makes the, the boss a bit upset. I like to shoot in this, this corner too because it looks kind of very old style neighborhood. Everything is built on a hill. These signs keep going up. Rip down and a new one goes up to update people on the development and when they have to be out, how much money they're going to be getting. I thought I was going to get some money for being relocated out of my house, but it doesn't matter that I've been here three years. I'm not a Korean, so I don't get any money. I would just have to leave. It's 
warm, but it's, uh, it's a little chilly because it's still March and the um, rain's coming down. So we'll stop at this look at a little view here. That, that goes towards like Yaxi. And we'll stop at the old house here. This is the house that all the water flows into during the monsoon monsoon season. Okay, I'm gonna stop at this old house. I just have a wonderful day, the weekend's upon us. Talk to you later. Bye bye. Uh, I always think this is so poetic. Pigeons down there. Okay, bye for now.